now to brand new information that we're learning uh, into a, a road raid incident, incident that occurred, a shooting in fact, that occurred along one of the now very busy alternate routes because of that I-696 closure. Happened in Warren on Grossbeck between Stevens and Nine Mile, right at the height of the morning rush hour, and one of the bullets hit a driver in the shoulder. Sean Light following this story for us tonight. Sean, that shooter is still on the loose. That's correct, and police said they took a look every which way at this case, and they said tonight they have confirmed indeed it is a case of road rage. One driver firing 10 shots at another driver, and as you say, Kimberly, that driver with the gun still out there tonight. Rush hour on Grossbeck and Nine Mile coming to a dangerous halt this morning when a driver opened fire on another driver in heavy traffic. We heard four shots. Three, there was three, bang, bang, bang. Warren police tell us 10 shots were unloaded at this car, shots that were meant to kill. The driver of this car was hit in his shoulder. Police point out if that driver had a passenger or a child in his car, the shooting could have been deadly. Very lucky to be alive. We could be talking about a homicide at this time. Warren Police Commissioner Bill Dwyer calls the incident a very unusual case of road rage because it happened so quickly. A 20-year-old man from Warren on his way to work somehow got tied up in the incident with another driver. And that driver quickly unloaded a handgun into the victim driver's car. Area businesses say the area is one detour to get around the I-696 West project. And there is heavy construction in the area. They can see how drivers can quickly lose their cool. Police aren't sure if the violence was construction related, but they are sure it's a clear case of road rage. Especially now with all this construction is a, a big concern. I mean, pe people have to be patient. They have to take their time. They have to leave early. That's the key, keeping your cool, not engaging with any other drivers through these construction sites. In the meantime, police tonight, they're on the lookout for that uh, driver's car, the driver and the car. It's a silver Kia Soul, tinted windows, a man behind the wheel, a woman in the passenger seat. Kimberly? Sean, what about the gunshot victim? How's, how's that victim doing tonight? We just asked police. They say he's so lucky. He got shot in the shoulder, treated at the hospital. They expect him to be home any minute now. Yeah, that's good news. All right, Sean.